Lift the two keel panels in their center and insert four wires, two on either side of the butt seam. Tip one panel up a little to bring the keel edges closer together and twist the four wires loosely in place. Now wire your center frame in place. Drill a hole in the center frame about one and a half inches above the keel seam. Align the frame on the lines you drew 3 and 3 16 inches forward of the butt seam. Now drill a hole through the left keel panel which is one half inch from the keel line and an eighth of an inch from the frame on the bow side of the frame. Drill another hole that is on the right keel panel which is a half inch from the keel line and an eighth of an inch from the frame on the stern side of the frame. Insert a wire through these holes and loosely twist the wires. The frame may be floppy and want to fall over. Prop it up with something to hold it vertical. It will get wired fully in place later. Go to the bow end of the two keel panels and pinch the ends up vertically together. Clamp them together with a quick grip bar clamp or any other clamp that can be operated with one hand. Align the panel ends and insert the wires at the ends from the outside and bend them over the keel line and twist them loosely. While the ends are still pinched together, Drill several more holes through the panels at the bow until you have holes every two inches for the first foot of the keel line. Insert these additional wires. Make sure not to tighten the wires at the ends so tightly that a pinched appearance remains in the end of the keel panel after the quick grip clamps are removed. Drill extra holes and insert wires also for the last foot of the stern.